Hey, this is Paul from Wondershare Mobile Trans. And if you use a smartphone in 2022, then you 1000% will use WhatsApp. Everybody seems to use it now because it's nice and easy to send videos, pictures, documents. You can do video calls. You can do almost everything. And now what you can do as well is add a status to WhatsApp. And sometimes you might want to save or download a WhatsApp status. And you might be sat there thinking, well, how do I do it? Well, in this video, I will tell you exactly how to do that. And as well as today's topic, we have a competition running so you can win a brand new iPhone 14. And I'll tell you about that a little later in the video. But before we get started, if you're new here to the Mobile Trans channel, then why not subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of the videos that we upload to the channel. Now, let's get into today's video. WhatsApp is now got bigger and better than ever. And like I said in the introduction, you can do almost anything with it. And now you can also upload a status to it as well. But what if you want to save that status? Well, let me show you how you can do that. And it is really simple to do so. And of course, today I want to tell you about a competition that we're running at Mobile Trans where you could win yourself an iPhone 14. So stick around for that. But first, let me show you how you can download your WhatsApp status on a computer. WhatsApp has enabled you to use WhatsApp web and that is something that we need to have a look at for this. So the first thing you need to do here is open your browser and go to whatsappweb.com. Then you need to open the WhatsApp app on your smartphone and select the WhatsApp web option from the settings menu. You would then scan the QR code on your computer and then it will access your WhatsApp account. Next, click the status icon to the left of the new conversation option on the screen. From the status session, open the status of the contact you want to download by right clicking on the video, then select save image as or save video as. Now select the file directory or location where you wish to save the status. Finally, select that save button and then that is simply how you download the WhatsApp web status on your computer. So not too hard and simple to do so, but what if you want to download it on an iPhone? Well, let me show you. Unlike WhatsApp for your computer, the iPhone doesn't have a standalone way that you can do this, but there are a couple of methods if you still want to try and make sure you can save that status. Let me show you how you can save that status by using your iPhone and the screen recorder built in to the iPhone. You need to go to your settings or your control center and select the screen recording option. Then to save the video, you need to select start recording and then have a look at the status on WhatsApp. It will begin to record straight away. And when the movie is finished, you might then just save it to your photos in the iPhone and then you can view it from whenever you need to view it. So that is a simple, easy way to do it using a screen recorder. Now time to talk about our iPhone 14 competition and your chance to win one. And all you have to do is the following. You need to head over to the mobile trans Facebook and like the campaign post and in there tag two friends and leave your comment about what's your most surprising old picture after transferring to a new phone. Share the post with your comment and add the hashtag mobile trans and also the hashtag nothing changed after transfer. If you enter that iPhone 14 giveaway then good luck fingers crossed that you win that competition. Okay, let me show you how you can do this on your Android phone. And the question might be, is it simple as doing it on an iPhone and PC? The answer is, yeah, it's nice and simple. The one thing that you'll need to make sure is that you've got a file manager on your phone and you can do this by getting the Google File Manager. Some phones don't have a file manager or this Google File Manager installed by default. So as long as you have that, then we can continue and this is what you need to do. You need to launch WhatsApp and look for the status that has to be downloaded. Secondly, select the file file manager program, then the three dotted symbol in the upper right corner, followed by the settings option. You then need to swipe the show hidden files option on the far right, then return to internal storage, WhatsApp, media and statuses. You may now see the whole WhatsApp status you watched on WhatsApp and downloaded WhatsApp status videos on an Android smartphone. And it is as simple as that to do it on Android. but 
There is also one other option and this is from a third party piece of software. This app is called Status Saver and is a third party piece of software which does exactly what its name suggests and it saves those statuses from your WhatsApp. The best bit about this app is that it can save it right to your gallery with just a few clicks. So let me show you how you would do it. Download Status Saver for WhatsApp from the Google Play Store and just make sure your device is older than Android 6. Launch the app and navigate to Status Saver. Open WhatsApp which will display the images and videos. You have the option to delete, save or share the WhatsApp status. And it is as simple as that. And these methods that we've discussed in today's video make it nice and easy for you to download a WhatsApp status just in case you ever need it again. And of course, my favorite is that last one we just spoke about with Status Saver because it makes it nice and simple. It's an app and it's really easy to use. If this video helped you out, then let us know in the comments below which of these methods was really good for you. And tell us how many statuses have you saved since using these methods. We're quite interested to know. Remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel and turn on that notification bell. And if you enter our iPhone 14 competition, then just quickly have a look on Facebook and Twitter for all the information there. And good luck if you enter that competition. And we will see you in the next video.